Hello friends, today we are going to see how to find the intersection of two linked lists. So you can see here, these are the two linked lists. So the start of one linked list is pointed by P and the second linked list is pointed by Q. And these two linked lists intersect at one point and E is the intersection point. So if you are given the heads of two linked lists means if you are given these pointers that is P comma Q then how will you find out the intersection point of these two linked lists. So let's see the steps. <laughs> so the first step is calculate length of both linked lists as L1 and L2. So if you have not seen my previous video of calculating the length of a linked list then please watch that video which will help you in this algorithm. So by using the length function we will calculate the length of the linked lists. So for this linked list the length will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 7 is the link length of this linked list and for this linked list 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 is the length of this linked list. Now the next step is calculate the difference. D is equal to absolute value of L1 minus L2. So obviously we have to do 7 minus 5. So D is equal to 2. Let's go to the third step. Move D nodes in longer linked list. So in the longer linked list that is of length 7 move D nodes. So we have to move 2 nodes ahead because D is equal to 2. So let's move by 2 nodes ahead. So first and this is the second. So we have moved the pointer by 2 nodes in the longer linked list. This is the longer linked list. Now, the fourth step is then move by one step in both linked lists till P is equal to Q. Means this step will be in while loop. The breaking condition will be P equal to Q. So let's move both the pointers by one, by one step. So P will move by one step and Q will move by one step. So whether P is equal to Q? No. So let's go to the next iteration. P is moved by one step and Q is moved by one step. So is P is equal to Q here? Yes. P and Q both hold the same address. This means they both point to the same node. So this is the intersection point of our linked list. So this is how we find out the intersection of two linked lists. In my next video we will see an another approach to do the same that is finding the intersection of two linked lists. Hey friends, please subscribe to my channel as I post algorithm videos every day. And if you want a video on any particular topic then please mention in the comment below. Thank you.